just a beautiful yeah, scale. Oh, she does. I like that. So can you believe it's happening? <laughs> it, it feels like you've been planning for 10 years, yeah. you know, but with all the detail and the arrangements and everything that's going on, we'll absorb it, it's happening. Mm -hmm. you, you've, you've done a great job in putting together a wedding day. You've done an even greater job in all of the preparation that you've gone through with the Catholic Church. It's just been, um, beautiful to watch you guys grow. And you're doing this all in the right way. You gotta look at the builders that taught you how to build and carry that with you. And that's what makes it so great when family gathers and we see it, what it all is. Are you ready to get married? Yes. yes. I'm ready to stop talking. Yeah. <laughs> so if you'll come up here. You come here freely. You come here without any pressure or reservation to give yourselves to each other in marriage. I do. I do. In our Jewish heritage, we look at how we've been shaped, and will you love and honor each other as husband and wife for all the days of your life? I will. I will. I, George Aaron, take you, Meredith Marie, to be my wife. I promise to be true to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, and I will love you and honor you all the days of my life. I, Meredith Marie, take you, George Aaron, to be my husband. I promise to be true to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health. I will love you and honor you all the days of my life. May I have your right hands. What God has joined together, no one must ever divide. You're now husband and wife. What do you give as a sign of this love and fidelity? Rings. Rings. A half hour ago, they wouldn't have been able to say that. <laughs> <laughs> Almighty God, <clears throat> in the rain we see a sign of infinity, for it is without beginning or end. Bless these rings as a sign of love and fidelity in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. I repeat after me. Meredith. Meredith. Receive this ring. Receive this ring. As a sign of my love and fidelity. As a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. And of the Son. And of the Son. The Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit. It, it worked? Yeah. <laughs> George. Oh, <laughs> that's it. George. Receive this ring. Receive this ring. As a sign of my love and fidelity. As a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. What else do you give as a sign of your life? A kiss. <laughs> My family and faith, pray that my sacrifice and yours might be acceptable to the Almighty. May the Lord accept our sacrifice and our hands. With the praise of the Lord in his name, for our good and good of all his holy church.
Receive in your kindness, Lord God, the offerings that we bring in gladness, that in your fatherly love, this sacrament of matrimony may be a blessing, for we believe in your divine providence that you've brought this couple together to live a life in you forever and ever. Amen. Body of Christ. Amen. I Almighty God, unite the hearts in a never-ending bond of pure love of your son George, your daughter Meredith. May your children bring you happiness. May your generous love for them be returned to you many times over. May the peace of Christ live always in your heart and in your home. May you have true friends that stand by you both in joy and in sorrow. May you be ready and willing to help and comfort those who come to you in need. May you find happiness and satisfaction in your jobs. May daily problems never cause you undue anxiety, nor the desire for earthly possessions ever dominate your lives. But rather, may your heart's first desire be always what is good and waiting for us in that great and that eternal wedding feast. May the Lord bless you with a happy life of many years together. May you enjoy the peace that comes from living a good life. And after you've served God loyally here on earth, may God welcome you to the eternal wedding feast of heaven. We ask all of this in the spirit that hovered over creation in the spirit that was with Jesus at the wedding feast in Cana, and the spirit that is with us today and leads us forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Rise. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. <clears throat> May Almighty God continue to bless us in God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our celebration in church is ended but our celebrating is not ended. Let us go in peace. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God. Okay. Please. Aaron, you're probably going to get played in the next few years or so. <laughs> but don't think of it that way. Think about the joy of going through this. I remember this to this particular day, and uh, best of luck to both of you. Meredith, you've given us a lot of joy in your life. Aaron, you've been very gracious to with us, and we've enjoyed your company the last year or so that we've known you and such like that. Best of luck to both of you. Meredith, Meredith is brilliant. I, I've never met one of the smartest women in my life, and and Aaron, Aaron is taken back by that because she's so brilliant. They get and it, it's awesome. It's just to see their conversations at their house. You know, living with them for two months, to see their conversations that they have to each other, and you know, they actually connect. And it's that's really hard to find, like someone on a level where you can sit there and just have a real conversation about not not BS, just just you know, and, and connect with. And I saw that, you know, and. Which is weird for me because I saw my brother twice a year for the last 13 years or so, of, thanks to the military. And now we see each other every day and we want to kill each other. So. Yeah, he is. And actually, that is the best wedding present I can give them right now. I leave on Sunday for my new job. So, Aaron, I haven't really gotten a chance to know you, you know, the whole not going to Albuquerque thing. Um, but I think anyone here can see how happy you make her and how happy that makes all of us who know her and love her so much know that. You will take such amazing care of her, and I am so excited to get to know you as you guys spend your life together. So this is, this is the beginning. Um, so if everybody would please raise their glass and help me wish them a lifetime of happiness, prosperity, and of course love. Cheers to God.